For one hour each day for a week, students in grades 3 through 12 at CLK schools were on computers and iPads dragging, dropping, and writing lines of code for the National Hour of Code initiative. Computer science teacher Mike Rowland says the Hour of Code coincides with the school's long-term goal of producing tech-savvy students. We're trying to teach them to learn anytime, anywhere, and to be able to do this. Take up any piece of technology and use it as a learning tool, as a tool for life. At the lower grade levels, coding starts with the fundamentals. We were working on a little project of just learning basics of how to make a shape pop up on the screen, a, a rectangle, and then we did a, a few rectangles to make a, a letter then. And you write rect, like it's for rectangle, and then, then you write numbers that make it bigger, wider, and longer. And the higher the grade level, the more advanced it becomes, like creating a video game. You run and you jump over like zombies and, and you get like first aid kits and crystals and batteries to operate the spaceship. According to the Bureau of Labor and Statistics, there will be an estimated 4.2 million jobs in computing and information technology in the U.S. by 2020. Roland says the Hour of Code is about teaching the students to think outside the box and to cultivate a passion for a growing career field. You don't have to just accept what somebody else tells you you can do with it. You can make it do what you want. And that's really cool when you see kids be successful in that and they have that, wow, I did that. Someday I probably want to grow up and do it. I want to make video games like alien games like these. Sarah Blakely, TV6 News, Calumet.